be possible. Then what's what's very interesting to me, and this is a question I keep asking myself, but I don't get an answer. Everybody asks the question about elections to Congress Party, and I am proud that the Congress Party has had a open, transparent election. Why is nobody interested in elections in other parties? Why does nobody ask the question, why isn't there an election in the BJP? Why isn't there an election uh, in the other regional parties? Nobody seems to be interested in this question. After bifurcation of United Andhra Pradesh, and uh, the Congress party lost their political address, does Congress and you particularly feel any regrets on that? Even though from the new state, there is no Congress power in Telangana. The people talking about this, sir. Yeah. So, your question is? The particularly about the Jodo Yatra enters in Congress, oh, yeah. Andhra Pradesh, the people of Andhra Pradesh, and people are discussing that. After the bifurcation of United of Andhra Pradesh, Congress has lost their political address in Andhra Pradesh. And later, there, there is no power in Telangana after new state form. Okay, so so as far as the bifurcation goes, the main thing from my perspective and from the Congress party's perspective is that when this bifurcation took place, certain commitments were made to the people of Andhra Pradesh. And we believe that those are fundamental commitments and they are commitments made by the Indian Union to the people of Andhra Pradesh and we think those commitments should be fulfilled. So that is our single most important observation that those commitments that were made that includes Polavaram, that includes special status, those should be fulfilled. Sir? As far as the Congress party is concerned, we have had a tremendous response uh, to our yatra. In fact, a lot of our leaders are quite surprised at the enthusiasm and the response we've had. And I think this is a very good starting point to build the Congress party in Andhra Pradesh. Thank you. Thank you. My stand, my, I have now started to understand a bit of Telugu. <laughs> My stand on the Amravati issue is very clear. Let me answer now. Next step will be answering in Telugu. First step is answering your question. Uh, we do not think that the idea of having three capitals is a sensible, efficient idea. We think that Andhra Pradesh should have one capital and we think that capital should be Amravati. That is our position. We also don't, we, I met yesterday the people who have given the land for the capital and who have been cheated. And we, I would like to reiterate here that we stand by those people and we will defend the rights of those people.